Ayuba. Um, when I first announced seven sports Sundays, my expectations were I've been trusting God for a level up in my spiritual life and for miracles and transformation in the mind of people. And during the seven Super Sundays, I have seen people's lives being transformed and the testimonies that came in were mind-blowing. And for myself, I, I experienced my own testimony. I was able to scale through the university, academic success, and my business. And also my career has been booming. And I want to thank God. Seven Super Sunday was amazing. And I look forward to another Seven Super Sundays. Thank you. I'm Pastor Henry Peter. And first and foremost, when I heard the servant of God talk about seven super the dark supernatural, what really came first to my mind was about the pattern of how God moves. In every move of God, there was always a sound that precedes, precedes his move. And I take it that this is a season by which God is said to precede his people, most especially people in this territory. So there was a massive expectation actually in my heart and today marks the end of Seven Super Sunday, and of which I can say boldly that my expectations were made. Personally, I've received word from the servant of God. That's word from God through His And I think God has really visited us this season. Thank you so much. Hello there. My name is Hamidi Marcus, a member of the prayer department. Uh, when I heard about this uh, Seven Super Sunday, it occurred to me that a program like that happened two years ago. And this time around, it is being touched as the supernatural. So the expectation that comes to me is that I'm going to experience the supernatural throughout some weeks. And today being the final day, it was another moment in the glory of God. Things are just moving so easy in the glory of God, while we experience the miracles, signs, wonders, powerful teachings that really edified my spirit. We anticipate more of these programs as more life will be transformed, more chains of darkness will be broken, and people will be liberated from shackles of darkness. Thank you. Hi, my name is Debbie Ekweme, and I'm a minister with the Source of Glory Network International. Um, what? came to my mind when I heard about the seven super Sundays well first I would say I was very excited I was excited why because I just felt like it's a time for visitation you know God doesn't just send his word except he is set to visit his people God has remembered his people and he is set to visit them and of course um, right now after everything is done I can say indeed the Lord has visited his people I got a word from the Lord I saw different miracles, signs and wonders happen in this place. There was a massive show, a display of the power of the Lord and um, the revelation of the word of the Lord that will never leave us. Uh, please, if you have not followed, I will want you to go back and listen to those messages. Very, very important and very key. Amen. God bless you. Hi, my name is Esther Samuel from the PR department. When I first heard about Seven Super Sundays, I was... Wow, seven Super Sundays, I'm expecting to see the power of God on display, the raw power of God, see the wisdom of God expressed through the Word. And seriously, I saw that, I heard the Word of God was released with precision. It was just top notch, all glory to God. Everyone was blessed, I was blessed, yes. And if you've not followed the videos online, please do. Um, the messages were powerful. The, we saw the raw power of God, we saw people healed, we saw transformations of life, we saw people, they gave their lives to Christ and it was what, what, what the time spent in the presence of God. Finally, I'm really looking forward to more of this, more of Seven Super Sundays. Thank you very much. Hello, my name is Elizabeth Frank from Worship Team Department of SGNI Global. When our father, Apostle Jonathan Lagang, announced um, the se seven Super Sundays to the supernatural, I had a lot of expectations and I knew that God was going to meet his people at the point of their every need. First Sunday came and passed, and today is the last. And I tell you, the glory of God was made manifest and it was so weighty and evident in our midst. We really thank God for such an amazing experience of the power and the presence of God. And we pray that the next one is going to be glorious and better. Thank you very much. My name is Pastor Victor Douglas. 
pastor with Sons of Glory Network International. Um, Seven Super Sunday was actually an awesome experience when it was first announced by our father. It um, built a weight of faith in my spirit and I knew it was time for a shift personally in my life and I knew as a territory also we were going to experience something massive. And coming to the end of um, the, the, the seven Super Sundays, um, this is my own testimony that I have finally experienced that shift in my spirit, the shift of faith, the shift of believing in God's ability and God's power. We saw that through the testimonies and through the miracles that were wrought all through the seven Super Sundays. And this played a major role in activating and shifting my faith and bringing me into the same experience of the supernatural. Truly and indeed, it was indeed an experience to reckon with and we bless God for such a miracle and such a blessing. Thanks be to God and also for using our Father and God's servant, Apostle Jonathan Ladan. Thank you so much. With so much love, we say thank you. There are 14 of you, inside and outside. Take that grace. Take that grace. Take, take it now. Let that man to find you. Find you. Man or woman, boy or girl. Contact that anointing now. Just help them. <laughs>